So what you're seeing here is a clockwise rotation of the upper jaw. We fixed this upper jaw with the help of four plates. There's a little bit of a gap there. Clockwise rotation with an advancement of three millimeters. We are improving the middle third of the face here, making the face more proportional, which is the keystone for facial aesthetics. Now, we're gonna show you what we've done in the lower jaw. Look at that chin. So the chin has been contoured, chin has been augmented, chin has been advanced, both horizontal vertical dimension, but that's not all. I hope you can see the plate inside. Let me start yeah. so you get some light as well, so you can see the plate inside, beneath the nerve. So that's from the sagittal osteotomy. There's a gap here. That gap is to counter the clockwise movement on the lower jaw. Let me this gap there. All right, let me show you a similar thing on this side. Gap on this side, starting all the way at the end. And that's the sagittal split. Extended sagittal split, I would call. It's just a small piece of bone that's continuous, which is holding the mental nerve. Now, on the chin, there you see, huge advancement, both horizontal, vertical, and also increase in the width of the chin. So we've done all of this in one go. It's got excellent bite. So not an issue with that. So we're doing all this to improve his facial balance, his facial proportions, to give him a smile that's toothy, like he had a smile that wasn't visible at all. His teeth wasn't visible when he used to smile. And plus we've increased the middle and the anterior lower third of the facial height.